Are we living in a world of false comfort? We trust our technology, our satellites, our telescopes. We believe that they can help us see every thread that is coming our way at our Earth. But yesterday, a cosmic bullet whizzed past our planet and almost no one and none of our telescopes had seen it coming. Our next report telling you more. Asteroid. Silent, ancient and unpredictable. Lurk in the vast darkness of our solar system. These cosmic wanderers are not just relics of creation. They are potential planet killers. Capable of ending life as we know it in a single catastrophic strike. Humanity's confidence in its technology is misplaced. For all our telescopes, satellites and observatories, we know shockingly little about the rocks hurtling past our fragile world. On May 21st, we got another wake-up call. A house-sized asteroid, designated 2025 KF, hurled past Earth at a blistering 41,600 km per hour. At its closest approach, just 115,000 kilometers away, less than a third of the distance to the moon. It zipped past our planet at 1730 GMT on May 21. That's a cosmic near miss, a hair's breadth in astronomical terms. The most unsettling detail, we only spotted 2025 KF two days before its flyby. Despite a global network of sky-watching technology, this 32 to 75 foot wide space rock was discovered by astronomers in Chile's Atacama Desert on May 19. It slipped through the cosmic net until it was almost upon us. Had it been bigger or on a collision course, the warning would have come far too late. NASA assures us that 2025 KF posed no threat if it would have burnt up in Earth's atmosphere, if it had struck. But the late discovery is a stark reminder of how vulnerable we remain. There are nearly 40,000 known near-Earth asteroids, and about 4,700 are classified as potentially hazardous. Many more, like 2025 KF, are still hidden in the dark. Our planet's safety depends on constant vigilance and faster detection. But as yesterday's close shave proves, the universe is full of surprises. And the next asteroid may not give us a second chance. Bureau Report, we on World is One.